has made, especially on the defensive end. When he was with the Nets, he was the guy you attacked on defense. Giannis puts up a three, can't hit it, missed a couple in game one. Working on all shots going left, and that's the first one he gets tonight. Turnover in the hands of Brown. When it's coming from the inside out, it's getting down into the team first. And Al Horford there with good defense. From Boston on Giannis, we'll see. Well, they didn't come that time, and I think that's a smart move. Don't open up the threes when you don't have to. Giannis drives, but can't finish. The two headliners, Grant Williams on the floor for the first time. Finds Horford, gets it deep, and denied by Giannis. A couple of blocks already for the Bucks. Posting up Grant Williams. Giving up a few inches there. Giannis on the single coverage loses the handle. And the Celtics up 12 to 3. Celtics really sharing it well. Assisted by Giannis. Giannis misses again. Second chance. Bobby Portis for three. No. Significant always, especially in game one. Plus 23 with a ball and minus 11 with a ball before. Two Celtics hit the deck. Connaughton. Lays it in. Robert Williams with a hard fall. Tatum there for the follow. Couldn't corral it. Carter comes away with a rebound. Giannis driving on Williams. Giannis with a two-handed jam. They lead by 14 points. They've already switched it to a 15-point lead early. Giannis misses again. Well defended by Boston. White for Horford. Running the floor. In the starting lineup tonight for the injured Marcus Smart. Got a quad bruise. Here is Matthews. The little floater is good. One of their few offensive bright spots with four made threes. Carter on a screen from Giannis. And Devon Carter. Carter now is fourth year out of West Virginia. And Devon Huggins there. Two of the Hall of Famer. Giannis had a steam on his way. Runs into a wall in Grant Williams. You can't run through Grant Williams. As he announced a really unsuccessful challenge, but take the basket away. And Giannis leaves it for Pat Connaughton. Nice find by Giannis out of the Kumpo. Well, that all comes off of the blitz of Tatum. Giannis goes right back at him. He is fouled. And one for out of the Kumpo. In this first half, the lead has been as big as 22. And Giannis able to finish off a three-point trip. His brother, Thanasis. Then you can lead with your voice. Williams is three for three from three-point range. Giannis stepped on the baseline. Pritchard, now Tatum. Step back three on its way, and no good. Giannis clears it away. Bucks with seven turnovers this quarter. They are down 20 as the football goes, and misses. Crawford defending. Game two, Eastern Conference semifinals, the two and the three seed. Boston and Milwaukee, and no Marcus Smart. That's going to be a foul on Giannis. Early in the year, Stan, Boston gave up a ton of big leads. That was part of their story. They had three big stories going early. Was trying to change a little bit of the way they played. They answered all of those, and from January 1st on, they were the best team in the NBA. Attack them, go by them, get to the basket. If Boston controls, they do not. They didn't have much time there. Tatum with Giannis on him. Dribbled it off his foot, and now a tie-up with... Giannis is ready to go down here. He takes on Robert Williams and scores. Oh, and a mean mug to go with it. Giannis out of the Kumpo. David Guthrie, the crew chief, flipped in the ball. Giannis pitched it back to the official. It's that ball movement again for Boston. Jalen Brown sets him up beautifully. Giannis knocks down a three. His first made three of the game. His third three-pointer. He's got 13. Out of the Kupo, lost the handle. Tatum to Brown. After that brilliant first quarter. Giving Giannis a three, he'll step in for a long two, and that's one area of his game that is, has improved so much. High bruises, quad injuries, they happen. Pritchard is in for White. Brown pulls up on Carter. As we check in with Stephanie Reddy. 
Well, B.A., you mentioned about the stinger. I happened to be in the back hallway in game one when Marcus Smart was returning from halftime. So he was constantly getting banged up, and in the third quarter, I, no I noticed he was on the floor at least twice. So it's continuing pounding, and that's why they're just keeping him out for sure. There's no question, if you're Marcus Smart, you're gonna get screened a lot, and having to try to get over the screen is tough. Five to shoot here for Boston. Brown finds Williams. Lost the handle there. Got to get one up here. Pritchard. And he's got by Lopez. And that's a shot clock violation. Five to shoot here for Boston. Brown finds Williams. Lost the handle there. Got to get one up here. Pritchard. And he's got by Lopez. And that's a shot clock violation. Well, this offense is looking more like game one than the first half of game two right now. It's one drive and kick and a three. Milwaukee down 20. Shot clock at five. Giannis just powers his way in. Spins and lays it in with a left hand. For Boston cashing in. They've been just two of 12 in this third quarter at the time of that. That timeout is Giannis goes strong and scores on Williams once again. Head basketball coach for the Duke women, and there's another coach in there too. Bill Belichick, Brad Stevens, and Giannis count that and one. Can't finish it. Allen kept it alive, but right to Pritchard will sit him down for a spell. He's been nursing this. Hamstring injury was ineffective. Here goes Giannis. Spins off Horford. Horford knocked it out of his hands. Hits the floor. Recovers it. And now Giannis losing the handle. Tatum with a steal. Tatum going up. Top of the floor down. The Celtic defense reestablishing itself. Portis knocks down a two. You make them, you usually win. Budenholzer's betting you don't make them for four wins in a series. As Giannis plays his way in, scores on Horford. Now Tatum, four to shoot. Tatum rises up, no good. Ah! Excellent defender as well. Anadokupo takes White, throws it off the glass to himself, and is fouled. Excellent defender as well. Anadokupo takes White, throws it off the glass to himself, and is fouled. Big third quarter as they get the countdown on Giannis. And he misses again. He struggled for the line. 72% in the regular season, but under 65% here in the playoffs. Javon Carter. Bobby Portis now up and over Horford. Horford got a piece of that. And a collision underneath with all these great defenders. Big possession for Milwaukee is out of the group of He's denied by Robert Williams. Right now, they're having a share. <laughs> the, the fan club is growing here in Boston for Grant Williams now in his third year. Connaughton goes to the hole, lays it up and in with the left hand. Williams with a rebound. Jalen Brown tees it up. Missed it. When the Bucks have been on a surge. And a couple of surges in the third and one here in the fourth. Now Allen goes to the basket and lays it in. That's what we're talking about. Can turn the corner and do whatever they want. Here's Brown for three. No. Giannis with a rebound. Milwaukee down 14. We approach the five-minute mark. Do the Bucks have enough time? Out of the cool pole. Takes Horford down. He throws it off the window and Horford recovers it. I'm not sure where that was headed. And he knocks it down. The Bucks started nine for nine. There's still a lot of time in this game. The Celtics are still going to have to score some. They only really scored 29 in the half. Those two possessions, Tatum and Brown, might be the two that do it. Giannis just powers his way in once again. Brad Williams hit the deck. Coming now. Celtics have hit 101 at 65 in the first half. And Giannis turns it over. And now the Celtics start to sniff that game to victory. 
four times to knock you out. Is this sustainable for Boston? You think? Well, I think it is, but they're going to have to mix things in. I saw guys tonight 